All right, so in amongst my travels today, I went to Petco and I got myself <laughs> two new tarantulas. Um, one is a curly hair and the other one is a Mexican red leg. So I am going to go ahead and get their enclosures together. Um, uh, let's see, the scientific name is Tlitocatal albopilosis, which is curly hair, and I have named her Inovendil, and then the Mexican red leg is Brachypelma Amelia, and I've named her Elephane. So, we are going to go ahead and get this one for in a in Ovendil first. <laughs> um, so I made up the substrate a little bit ago. Um, both of these do like to. Um, they are both uh, terrestrial, so I'll give them enough substrate to burrow in if they choose to and also I'll give them some bark to hide under if they don't feel like uh burrowing all right I think that's good yeah and then let's see here yeah I think this will be all right That'll close just fine. Perfect. Uh, let's dig it out under there. Um, get it kind of steady for our. Uh, let's build more in there on top. There we go. Beautiful. All right. And we're going to put a little bit of leaves in there. To make it look nice for her. Good. And we got water dish. Do 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 do. All right. So all right. I think that's got it good. Gives her a place to get up on top if she wants. Gives her a place to hide and to crawl into if she wants to. And gives her her water dish. So, everything a girl and girl will need. Alright, so we've got my girl. This is my curly hair. Alright, let's see here. I'm not sure which box she's in, so I'll have to open them both and... See. Oh, this is her. She's very much small. She's very much smaller than my other curly hair. Um, my girl Trio um, is the curly hair, and she is full grown. She is definitely an adult, but this little girl is looks like a juvenile. Because she does not have a whole lot of curly hair on her yet. <laughs> but you can tell she's good and healthy. Got a nice big old butt. And we shall let her get down in there. And explore. There you go, baby. All right. So I'll give you some water in a few minutes. There you go, baby. Good girl. Yeah, you can just see her hair starting to get longer, but uh, she's she's definitely young. But she's she is now mine. Haha. <laughs> I couldn't help it. 
All right, so that's one girl down. There we go. Perfect. All right, I'm not going to block it because i got to give them water here in a few minutes. All right, now here's for my girl, Ella Fane. All right, we're going to do the exact same thing with this one. All right, let's see here. Uh, yeah, that fits in there all right. I think I can make it work. Definitely want to bury it a little bit. going to put any leaves on this one I don't think in here because there's really just not really a whole lot of room uh, piece of wood is a little bit bigger than I expected but that's okay all right so now oh, that's a little bit too much in there there we go. I think that'll work. Yeah. Yep. No, no leaves in this one. All right. So there, water dish. All right. So got a nice little hide under there. Got her all, got it all set to go. And here we go. Let's get this pretty girl out. She's a bit bigger than the curly hair. Um, not as big as my other uh, striped knee, or I'm sorry, red leg. <laughs> uh, striped knee, I don't know where that came from. Um, oh, calm down, here we go. Okay, here she is. Look at that pretty girl. Oh, yeah. Look at how beautiful she is. But like I said, she is definitely not as big as my other girl, but that's okay. She'll she'll grow. So all right, girly. Off you go. No, let go of my hand. Let go of my hand. There you go. Oh, you still got it. There you go. <laughs> All right, beautiful girl. Let's get you down. Go on down. Yep. Explore. Do a little exploring, darling. Boop. No, don't go rubbing your butt at me. All right. Very good. All right. Um, now, there was another one up there that I was going to get. Um, it was a... She was a, another green bottle blue, which I have two of those already, but I was still going to get her. And uh, while we were getting her out to put her into the box for me to take her home, she decided to take a leap of death. Um, yeah, she was about four or five feet off the ground and leapt out of the ha out of her hands before we could do anything and uh, she ruptured her belly and i mean it was she, within minutes she was gone there was no saving her so unfortunately i couldn't bring her home um i it it happens i know but it still bugs me that it happened. <laughs> I was going to bring her home. She was pretty. Oh, well. It happens, though. So, these two bring me up to 48 total. Um, so, getting close to my, my 
goal of 50. You know, definitely have 50 with by, by summertime, I'm sure. I <laughs> uh, can't help myself, you know. These are my Mother's Day presents. And, you know, it's not going to be too long till it's my birthday. And, you know, you can't imagine what I'll get myself for my birthday. So, <laughs> yeah. All right. So, these are my two new girls. And as you can see, she's already under there, just chilling. There she is, yep. You can see her butt there. All right, so. Come on, there we go. Got it. All right, and this girl is... Looks like she's spinning some silk so she can web everything up. You can actually see the silk coming out of her butt there. Well, maybe not, but it's right there. So, yeah, she'll have this webbed up by the time I go to bed. <laughs> Alright, so that's my two new ones. I am so glad to have them in my collection and <laughs> give them a good home. So, I shall talk to y'all later. And I hope y'all have a good night. Bye!